Here's what's making news on Roadshow. Waymo and Lyft are teaming up for self-driving cars, although nobody's really sure what's going to come of it just yet. The two tech companies have agreed to a partnership that will foster further development of autonomous vehicles, although neither company is providing specifics. Either way, it's likely to be a sticking point for Lyft rival Uber, which is currently embroiled in a legal battle with the Google spinoff. Speaking of Uber, a U.S. judge has handed down an injunction to the former head of its self-driving program. Anthony Lewandowski has been officially barred from working on Uber's autonomous tech. More specifically, he's banned from working with LiDAR, the road scanning tech that's at the center of the intellectual property dispute between Uber and Waymo. Lewandowski announced that he was recusing himself from this kind of work back in April, but engineer testimony claims he still talks to the new program head on a daily basis. Your next Volvo or Audi infotainment system may have Android running in its veins. Both automakers have announced that their next generation infotainment systems will be built using Android, Google's mobile operating system. That means these automakers will have access to a vast library of first and third party applications that can run natively on their infotainment systems. Details remain scant, but if you're thinking of getting into Android app development, now seems like a really good time. Find more on these stories over at theroadshow.com. We'll talk to you tomorrow.